Welcome back everyone to another episode of Shea TV. My name is Marissa Hill and today we're going to be taking a look at a silhouette we have yet to do on the channel and these are called the Gazelle Bold and this is in the pink and green colorway. Let's take a quick CP. <music> to another unboxing and review if you're joining us for the first time welcome in be sure to hit that subscribe down below if you're not already subscribed to the channel and give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy these unboxing and fashion styling segments today we're going to be covering a brand new silhouette on the channel that i'm really excited for if you haven't already checked out my article on what i think are going to be the latest fashion trends for the year 2024 definitely go check that article out on shadestudios.com i talk about about how platform sneakers are going to be a huge trend this year. And of course, what better than to talk about the Gazelle Bolt. So we'll go through the overview of this, jump into size and fit, followed by how I saw this really fun pop of color. Then we'll conclude with where you can find these as well as how much they're going for on the retail side of things. So let's jump right into it. I have definitely been seeing a tick in what people are wearing here in New York and seeing this crazy transition into a definite high platform silhouette. So if you're somebody who's looking to add some additional height, but you also want to be quite fashionable. I feel like the Gazelle is the perfect sneaker to start with. Definitely going to get a couple extra inches from this thick triple midsole that you'll see on the bottom of this Gazelle. And if you're somebody who loves the Gazelle silhouette, and again, you're looking for that additional height, this is also a great package in its own to go with the Gazelle Bold. As far as the color schemes go, I really am enjoying the Gazelle Bolds and these really fun color combinations. They do have more of a black and white tone but I do feel like these vibrant colors are so fun. So as far as the color scheme of this, it's this nice pop of pink and I decided to do a color combination with this pine green, which I think really complements the pink perfectly. We've got pink laces and a really cool textured tongue in white. And then we've got pops of green for the Adidas branding. Let's take a look at those details then jump into the side paneling. medial and lateral side of the sneaker same exact color blocking in the nice suede texture and that pink and then we've got three stripes and smooth leather in that green tone which you'll also see on the back of the heel the only difference on the lateral side is you are getting the gazelle uh, print in white which pops perfectly off of the pink. And then the interior for the insole is in pink and green as well. The sneaker is then completed with this beautiful midsole in a two-tone gum bottom. So we've got two layers of the gum bottom in a lighter shade, and then it gets a little bit darker on the third layer here. And then the gum bottom is completed on the bottom of the outsole as well. All right, so let's take a look at those details, then jump into size and fit.
far as size and fit goes, these definitely run on the larger side of uh, the scale. So I actually went half a size down. So I'm typically a seven and a half or a nine in women's. So I decided to go with an eight and a half in women's or seven in men's and these fit me perfectly. So definitely size down on this one if you're trying to figure out what is the best size range because these do run quite large. All right, so now let's jump into styling again. What a fun pop of color to style, especially as we're getting into spring. I feel like this is definitely a color combination you might want to try out. For the first look, I decided to wear this really cool multicolored Adidas zip up jacket, which has some nice colors that match the sneaker perfectly. And then I layered that on top of a denim tank with a matching denim maxi skirt. second look I decided to wear a denim ruffle dress that was a mini dress and I feel like denim just really pops and complements the sneaker perfectly. Then for the last and final look, I wore a cropped cream sweater with some nice basic light denim bands. So as far as the retail goes, these retail at $120. You can pretty much find these anywhere, any Adidas retail stores, online or in store. I picked up a pair of these in Foot Locker, but these are actually in Champs. They're also at Snipes. They're at JD Sports. They're on different uh, options like ASO. So you can definitely find these pretty much everywhere in different color combinations. But again, I feel like this is just such a great silhouette for added additional height a great price point but also just a nice fun two-toned looking shoe all right everyone that is it for this unboxing and review if you join us for the first time thank you so much hit that subscribe on your way out if you're not already subscribed to the channel and give this video a thumbs up my name is marissa hill this is shay tv we'll catch you all next episode